Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. What a wonderful So today's video is going to be a shower tour. So now that I'm in a new apartment, I figured I'd show you guys how I set up my shower behind me. And I also have these cabinets back there that have all of my body care. So I'm gonna show you guys my body care storage as well. And yeah, just keep you guys updated. And I did actually find my vlogging camera that I used to use. So let me know if you like this quality. I think the picture quality is great. I'm not quite sure about the sound. So let me know what you guys think. It might be a little echoey since we are in my bathroom, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'm just excited to show you guys kind of what I'm using, what's in my shower right now, what I use to organize it, and all of that great stuff. So let's get started with the shower. Okay, real quick, just giving you guys a big overview. So I do have this towel hook right here that I keep a little hair towel on, and my body towel goes on this suction cup hook, which I will link down below. And then if I open up the door, you can see I have a beautiful rainfall shower head, which I did also buy off of Amazon, and I will link that one as well. Ryan put that one on for me, and I'm so grateful. And then I have this wonderful suction cup uh, corner shelf, which I love. And then right over here, I've got my little, I don't even know, I can't remember what this is called. What is it called? <laughs> my shower gem is what it's called right here with all of my like tube products. I do still have one giant thing of shampoo down here just because I have this huge bottle and I'm scared it's too heavy to put on any of these suction cup ones. And then I have my phone holder. So let's go in depth on each shelf. So starting off up top with this one. Okay, so this corner shelf actually came in a pack of two and Ryan has the other one in his shower. So we actually have two bathrooms in this apartment and he's claimed the other one so I can put all of my stuff in this one. But I do have this loofah down here. I hooked my um, comb right here. You, it's pretty much another loofah hook or like a um, razor hook right here. And then I have my two face washes. I have the Pixie Retinol Jasmine Cleanser and my Clear Proof Cleanser right here. So those are my two face washes. I keep both of my body scrubs right here just because this is really the best place for them to fit. So I have the Creme Shop X Hello Kitty Caramel Pumpkin Latte and the Onyx Bathhouse Hot Mess Express. I've got my Jergens Natural Glow Wet Skin Moisturizer. I love this stuff, especially preparing for the summertime, um, just really in between when I do fake tan. So I do fake tan about once every two weeks or three weeks, and kind of in between that, I'll use this, and it really keeps me having like a nice glow to my skin. And then I've got my Bath & Body Works Coffee Lip Scrub. I love this stuff. I use it pretty much every single day in the shower, just when I remember <laughs> or when I see it. And then back in this corner, since I don't use this stuff as often, I've kind of tucked it in the back, but here is my Love Beauty and Planet Sulfate Free Shampoo Scrub. This is my absolute favorite and they discontinued it. I'm so mad. And then I have my Amika Soul Food Nourishing Hair Mask. Um, I don't know if I love this that much. I don't know if it's worth the money. If you guys have a hair mask that you really love, I have thick, frizzy, coarse, curly, naturally like wavy hair. So let me know if you have a um, hair mask that you love because I have yet to find one that I've fallen in love with. So just let me know down below, please. Okay, moving on to my shower gems. So I actually saw this on TikTok and fell in love with the look of it and just that it could hold so many things. And I feel like this is so much cuter than just having like a regular shelf, but it does hook on right here and it has this glue that you put on with it. Um, and I need to read the directions again on how to remove it, but just be really careful when you do that. Um, but yeah, so I have two of them facing each other and all my shower gels are over here wrapped in vanilla from Bath & Body Works. Midnight Amber Glow, this one is my perfect morning scent. Whipped Vanilla Chiffon, I've been absolutely loving this for the springtime. And then I've got my razor hooked on right here. This is my Flamingo Razor. Um, I originally bought mine from Target, but I found them at TJ Maxx and Marshalls too. And then I have this scalp scrubber, which I absolutely adore. If you have problems with uh, dandruff or eczema on your scalp, this is really, really good. 
And then this side I have my Philosophy Strawberry Guava Coconut Shower Gel. Love this stuff, it smells so fruity and yummy. I have my Joico Moisture Recovery Conditioner. So see, this is a smaller bottle, so it actually fit on here and it's not very heavy. I have my EOS Sensitive Shea Butter Shave Cream. I really do like this one. I have a little hair clip right here. Usually whenever I do my conditioner or my hair mask, I like to clip my hair up while I finish up on my shower and then kind of wash my conditioner out last. I have this little body scrubber that I got, I think from Marshalls. I have not used it in a while, but I do really like it for um, body scrubs that are in a tube. I just feel like that they apply much better when I put them on here first. So like the Bath and Body Works ones in the tube will go really well on there. And then I have this pumice stone that I've been using on my feet. I actually just got this last week and I've been using it and I've already noticed that my feet are much softer. I just picked this up at my local grocery store so totally recommend it. If you've noticed that your feet are a little crusty and dusty from winter time, this is really getting my um, heels and my toes sandal ready. And the last item over here is my phone holder for the shower. So it has a little clip. They've actually updated the design since I bought one in our old house last year, but you stick your phone in here and you do have to have the case off your phone or just like a really slim case on your phone. And you stick it right here, you lock it, and it is waterproof. You can also turn it. So if you wanted to watch TikToks, you totally could. And you can take it off. So if you have trouble getting your phone out later, and I did get the white one because it matches really well with my tile, but I've also had the black one in a black shower before, and it looks really good. And just to show you, this is what that suction cup hook for my towel looks like inside the shower. I don't love that, but I do like having a towel hook super close. So, you know, when I'm reaching out to get my towel, it's like really close by. Okay, so that is the shower. Now let's move on to these cabinets behind me and I'll show you guys my body care stash. So first off, I just wanted to show you that I have my towels in this cabinet right here. And this cabinet is for body care. So right now I really just have it in these two clear bins and then some overflow products like big scrubs and new things are on the side right here. But I got these two bins from Target and I think the bottom one um, I really enjoyed because I could kind of just pull things out. So I kind of sorted it from what I'm gonna grab first versus last is all the way in the back. Same thing with this one. And I went ahead and put the camera on a tripod just so you guys could see me really well. And I can put up the ring light but here we have it. Um, I have these two clear bins, both from Target. I love this one that has like the lip inside so I can just kind of take products out really easily. But I have it sorted from what I will reach for first to last. So like winter and fall is in the back. Same with up here, I have my body mists, my perfumes and my minis, and then like a few body creams that were too tall to fit up top. So I'll give you an overview of what I have over on this right hand side. So I just picked up this Living Proof Frizz Free Humidity Shield. So I've got this over here just to remind myself to try it out. I just picked up the Vanilla Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub. So I'm really excited to try this one. So this one is also in the front just to remind me that I should try it. Another new find is the I Heart Revolution Shower Shake in vegan mint chocolate and this was $4.99 from TJ Maxx so I'm excited to try this one. I have all of my moisturizing body washes over here, Sunshine Mimosa in the Stars and Midnight Amber Glow. They're just too tall to fit in the bottom bin and I feel like they don't really mesh well with the top bin so I put them over here. Back in the bag I've got all my like cylindrical products. So I've got my two body butters. I have Midnight Amber Glow and I have the Trader Joe's Brazil Nut Body Butter. And then also in the back, I've got my tub body scrub. So I have the Tree Hut's Velvet Coffee. I have the Trader Joe's Brazil Nut Body Scrub. And I have the Dove Brown Sugar and Coconut Butter Body Scrub. I am so excited to try this one, you guys. I've heard great things about it. And I feel like it's like a radiant. I don't know. It's definitely got some shimmer to it. So I'm excited to try this. And then also back here, I have my two soap bars. So this is a lavender one from Trader Joe's and this one is actually from Dionys Goat Milk. And then I've got this Rose Infused Exfoliating Bath Glove that I definitely need to try and put in one of my shower routines. And I've got an extra Burt's Bees cuticle cream that I actually need to put with my nail polish. Okay, I took the bin out of the closet just so I can actually show you guys what's inside of it because it was too hard getting inside of there. So of course first you guys can see these two Midnight Amber Glow body creams. 
I've got a few hand lotions in the Stars and Strawberry Pound Cake. I've got all my little minis. I've only got a few mini mists here, mini shower gels, and mini lotions. I've got some perfumes, Musky Musk from Dossier, and Champagne Toast, as well as Into the Night. And then every single one of my mists is here. So I've got Vanilla Swirl, Sol de Janeiro 71, Blush Cardigan, Twilight Woods, Beach Nights, Warm Vanilla Sugar, Christmas Cookies, Coconut Mint Drop, White Pumpkin and Chai, Almond Blossom, Vanilla Mocha Cafe, Fresh Coconut and Cotton, Twinkling Nights, Iced Sugar Plum, Velvet Sugar, Mint Chocolate Swirl, Vanilla Bean Noel, Frosted Wonderland, my prized possession from 2014, and Bonfire Bash. I'm actually gonna like reorder these because I have a few that I want to start using soon. And now for the bottom tier, which has all of my body scrubs that are in these tubes and all of my lotions and shower gels. So body scrubs, I have Pure Wonder, Midnight Amber Glow, Dionys Vanilla Bean, and Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. And for, I believe this is all lotions on the left side, I've got Midnight Amber Glow, Coco Paradise, Beach Nights. Oh, I do have Beach Nights in the shower gel. I wanted to put those two together. Pumpkin Cupcake, Champagne Apple and Honey, Twisted Peppermint, White Pumpkin and Chai, and Iced Sugar Plum. As far as shower gels, I've got Vanilla Mocha Cream, Among the Clouds, Fresh Coconut and Cotton, Cocoa Paradise, Life of the Party, Another Beach Nights, Champagne Apple and Honey, Iced Sugar Plum, Pumpkin Pecan Waffles, and Sweater Weather. Okay, so that is it for the bathroom, but I do wanna show you guys where I keep my everyday products because that, what I just showed you, is kind of my back stock. So I wanna show you guys where I put my Project Use It Up stuff, and that is gonna be in the bedroom. Okay, so here's a little overview of the top of my dresser where I keep most of the stuff that I get ready with on a daily basis. So the first thing that I actually have to shut off because it is pretty loud is my little skincare mini fridge and I just keep my everyday essentials in there, mostly serums. And then I have a little mirror so I can put on my serums there. I have this beautiful jewelry organizer and a little mason jar for my makeup brushes. I did also just buy this beautiful jewelry organizer from Target and I have kind of all the stuff that I couldn't fit on here. So this is all daily stuff. This is all not necessarily daily, just whenever kind of items. I have the two perfumes that I'm working on right here. As you can tell, this one's upside down, so I'm almost done with it. Same with this Kaoli. And then I have a, just a cute little clip right here from Target. And then this bin, I believe I got at Ross. And this holds all of my um, body care items that I'm using up, as well as my hairspray that I use daily and my... Um, body oil, which is not in my Project Use It Up, but I do use it every now and then. I've got my um, Victoria's Secret Pink ba Basic Vanilla. I've got my Bikini Zone um, Aftershade Cream in here too. My Wrapped in Vanilla Fine Fragrance Mist. Whip Vanilla Chiffon in the Fine Fragrance Mist. Enchanted Candy Potion Body Cream. Strawberry Pound Cake. Champagne Toast. A little mini Midnight Amber Glow. And another Strawberry Pound Cake in the lotion. And then right over here, I've got this organizer, which I got from Tuesday morning a long time ago, like maybe almost 10 years ago. Um, but it holds all my hair accessories. So I have little barrettes, some more clips some little seashell clips for summer, and then the biggest two are at the bottom. And then I've got these two little jars that I got from Dollar Tree a long time ago and DIY spray painted them teal, but I have my bobby pins in one and my hair ties in the other. And then I've got this, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be a jewelry organizer, but I use it to hold my headbands and my scrunchies. And I love this towel headband that I just have to show off from um, Kitsch. I got this actually at Marshalls and they have a ton of them right now. Um, in the beauty section, so totally get one. If you go to sleep with your hair wet, you need this so your pillow won't be wet anymore. I love it, so good. And I have the matching Kitsch 
um, spa headband that I use every single day while I wash my face. And then I have my Scentsy Wax Warmer right here. I don't have it on because I'm actually getting ready for bed, but that is my wax warmer, and I think this is Frosted Vanilla. Okay, so that is everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed that little bathroom tour slash updated body care tour slash I just showed you my whole collection. Oh, but I did forget to show you guys. These are so cool. Okay, I'll show you. So these are my skincare shelves, which I have all of my daily skincare. I've got a little red light um, therapy for acne. I've got my deodorant and lip balm, tweezers, just all of my daily stuff that I use every day for skincare. And I love these, these are also from Amazon. Like look how sleek that looks next to my light up mirror, you guys. I love this new apartment, especially the bathroom. I think I've spent the most time in the bathroom here than anywhere else. So I've been really, really loving it. But yeah, that is everything for this video. You guys will have to let me know what you think of the quality of this guy. I know when it gets in low lighting, it does kind of like glitch out. So I'll definitely have to work on that and make sure that I have proper lighting when I film. But yeah, let me know what you guys think and if I should keep doing this one or I should go back to using my iPhone, which is what I usually use. But thank you so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.